All right, so we are here with a different type of video. You know, usually I would have like a game right here. You know, we would react to like the gameplay, uh, the, the the funny moments, etc. But here, we're here to talk about something very serious. Uh, we're here to talk. <laughs> we're here to talk about Call of Duty. Uh, sorry, the new Call of Duty, whether it's like a Black Ops game, Modern Warfare game, etc. Now, if I'm being honest with you, I kind of knew that this game was going to be a, a Black Ops game, if I'm being honest. Um, we pretty much had, what, two Modern Warfare games in a row. Um, now, obviously, listen, I'm not a Call of Duty channel. Uh, again, I cover, like, you know, I wouldn't say every game, but I, I cover a lot of games on my channel. Anywhere from Call of Duty, uh, I don't know, Overwatch, Fortnite. Uh, Elden Ring, like uh, just literally different genres that I cover. Um, um, just any game you could think of, I'm most likely probably like reacted to, like reacted to the gameplay, um, covered the trailer. Like literally, I covered like a lot of games, and I've been doing this for about one year and a half. Um, and, and thank you guys so much for you know sticking along and watching the videos. I really appreciate it. And you guys have definitely, um, you guys have definitely like you know changed my life, man. Because uh, obviously, you know, I get to do. What I love to do, you know, and, and it, it's fun. Every video I love to do is, is, is super duper fun, talking video games, stuff like that. And, you know, of course, I like to, like, you know, uh, throw some jokes in there and stuff like that. I'm not really serious with none of this because at the end of the day, uh, it's just video games. And, you know, we all love video games. Now, uh, listen, let, let's get out of this mushy, ushy, good feeling stuff. It's time to get the negativity and violence. So that's, 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 that's time to get <laughs> that's time to get to that. Um, but not really, though. Um, let's talk about the new call of duty now if i'm being honest with you i knew this was going to be a black ops game like i said before because we've had two modern warfare games uh in a row we had call of duty modern warfare 2 and call of duty modern warfare 3 um so two modern warfare games so i knew like you know it it makes it like no shot they're gonna put three you know uh modern warfare 3 games in a row like that's not even like that's not even that's not even call of duty's like thing and it, honestly it's not really their thing to like put like two like back-to-back -back games in a row because it always went black ops then modern warfare black ops then modern warfare black ops then it always went like a back to back to back wait hold up 2012 2012 was black ops 2013 modern warfare 3 uh 2014 what was 2014 did, did the game come out in 2014 i think what was it advanced warfare or was it ghost i think it was one of those and then 2015 was uh black ops 3 2016 what was 2016? Uh, was it Infinite Warfare, I think? And 2017 was World War II. 2018 was... Was that Black Ops 4, I believe? 2019 was... Uh, um, 2019 was Call of Duty, Modern Warfare. Yep. And then uh, 2020 was Cold War. 2021 was... Uh, uh, was it Vanguard? Yep. 2021 was Vanguard. 2022 was Modern Warfare 2, and then 2023 was Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. So, um, like I said, they never, they never, they it is it's always a back to back to back to back to back, and then they would like chip in. If you if you go listen, if you notice the pattern, watch this. If you notice the pattern, it's always Black Ops Modern Warfare, Black Ops Modern Warfare, and then they they would throw in like a Call of Duty that like takes you back. It's like it's like a uh, I will I call those um, World War like Call of Duties. So like the World War, like the Call of Duty World War Two, the Call of Duty Cold War, the Call of Duty Vanguard. Those are like all the games that like, obviously like you know the, they have like you know uh, high definition graphics of course, but those games take place like you know in like the 1800s, 1900s type of thing. Like you know if you guys play those games, like you know what I'm talking about. Um, and, and so like those like it was always Black Ops Modern Warfare, Black Ops Modern Warfare, a World War Two game. Uh, and then like a throw off Call of Duty, so like Infinite Warfare. Listen, Call of Duty, I love you, but Infinite Warfare uh, was definitely a. Uh, it was it definitely threw me off if I'm being <laughs> if I'm being honest with you. Uh, definitely like the. I know I'm not here to roast Call of Duty, but like, here's what I would say: Infinite Warfare and World War Two back to back was a nasty combo. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like, I, I was disgusted. Um, other than that, we are here to talk about um, the new Call of Duty that's coming out this year. Now, if I'm being honest with you, I thought Call of Duty was... I thought they weren't going to drop this year, if I'm being honest with you. Uh, turns out, I think they are. Uh, I think they are. Uh, most likely, a Call of Duty Black Ops game is going to drop this year because it only makes sense. Two uh, Modern Warfare 3 games dropped... I said two Modern Warfare 3 games, sorry. Two Modern Warfare games dropped back-to-back. Uh, -back. That never happened. So, by default, they got to go um, back to uh, Black Ops. And if I'm being honest, I'm pretty excited with you. Uh, I'm pretty excited because, um, I mean, Black Ops is... Play like play style difference 
and just story wise as well like it's, it's very different obviously you know it's two different games um but it's obviously it's under one game and so you know we we really get to see because in my opinion i was always the modern warfare kid like black ops was black ops right like you know that was really known for for me that was really known for like the zombies and stuff like that obviously the multiplayer was good and everything like that but like I was more of like a Modern Warfare kid, you know. I don't know why. That's just the one that I, you know, that I just resonated with. Um, but I'm really excited for the new Black Ops game. Now, a lot of um, a lot of people were confused because they was like, "So, like, what is the new Call of Duty like Black Ops game going to be called?" I thought by default it was Black Ops Six because if you count it, Call of Duty Black Ops came like came out 2010. Call of Duty Black Ops Two came out 2012. Call of Duty Black Ops Three came out 2015. Call of Duty Black Ops uh, uh, Four came out uh in 2018 i believe and then call of duty uh cold war came out what in 20 was it was it 2020 i think um 2020 or 2021 and so right there those were five call of duty so i'm thinking automatically a six um but here's the thing though a lot of people some people might not count uh, they might not count like the Cold War as like the uh, as like a part of like the original story, which makes sense. I I, I listen. I understand that, um, and, and a lot of people might just call it like a um, how would you say? It? They might just call it like a um, not a DLC, not a DLC. Like how would you call that? It's like it it wasn't. I wouldn't say it was like a. It wasn't a part of like the original Call of Duty um, like story and stuff like that. So like it was really like just like a cast off like game. If that makes sense. Um, and if I'm being honest with you, man, I think that it, it does count because it's, it has the name with it. It like, it's called the black ops and then cold, like it's cold. War. Like it, it has the name. If it was like a, like a throwaway or like a castaway type of game, I don't think that they would, I, I think they would like try to like, like mash it in with like black ops four or something like that. Like, I, so this is why I think black ops cold war was like its own game. Um, and in my opinion, I think that the next Call of Duty, here's the thing though, here's the thing, see Call of Duty, they, they confuse me a little bit, like they confuse me sometimes, you know, um, like I said, I love Call of Duty, I love everything that they do, whatever, etc. but sometimes they confuse me, um, now about, no, 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 now about to say, I'm sorry, I just lied to y'all, I don't love everything they do, I'm so, I'm so sorry, because I just named two things that they, that I didn't like, so, I'm my bad about that one, I do not love everything they do, I love most things that they did, especially, you know, from my childhood, you know, because Call of Duty was literally my game growing up, um, but of course, you know, they made, like, some decisions, whether it was, like, you know, game-wise, taking some key things out, stuff like that, Call of Duty, I love you, but there's some things that you guys messed up big on, you know, which is okay. Every com every gaming, you know, development company, whatever, they all messed up on something, which is fine, you know. Um, but the thing is, no matter how much, you know, I rage at the game, no matter how much, no matter how many times, like, you know, they mess up on the game, whatever. For some odd reason, bro, if I don't play Call of Duty in, like, a while, like, I haven't played Call of Duty, like, and and I'll be honest, I haven't played Call of Duty in, like, seven months. Um, and, and if I'm being honest with you. I do miss it. I, I admit that. I do. I do miss it. Um, it. It just feels weird not playing the game, you know, especially when this is a game that I used to sweat. Like, like I used to sweat Call of Duty Black Ops 2 when I was a kid, like, for, like, five, six hours straight. And then, like, I would take, like, a little break. Bro, I feel like I was, like, LeBron out there. I feel like I was dropping 40 every game, you know. And then, and then when they put me in those hardy lobbies against the pros and, you know, scumping all them. I'm like, oh no. <laughs> I'm like, oh no, I can't handle this. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna lose on purpose so you can so y'all can drop me back into the Venezuela lobbies. I can no, I can listen. I cannot hang with those boys, bro. They they were going crazy. Especially those black ops two days. Oh man. But um but in reality though, I'm really excited for this new Call of Duty game. Now a lot of people were speculating they was like, all right, the new Call of Duty Black Ops game is gonna be called like Call of Duty Black Ops five, right? Which if you look at this screenshot right here, first of all, shout out to uh, Charlie Intel. Uh, he has a, he has like a Twitter or something like that. Uh, make sure you guys go follow him on Twitter. Like if you like Call of Duty, like he bro, this man be dropping gems. I don't even know where he gets his information from, but hey, I just learned. I just know I got it. Okay. Um, now this right here, I've pretty much seen this logo before. I've also watched Face Jazz video, and um, literally he actually helped me a lot. Well, he didn't personally help me, but I watched his video, and so like his like his knowledge on things actually helped me a lot with this video. Um, this right here is like the dog or whatever. I don't know, I forgot where this is from, but I we've all seen this before. I think this is like Rubius or something like that. 
it starts with like an R. If any of you, if any like the like the Call of Duty um expertise and connoisseurs, if you guys can help me out with this, uh, it's it's called R something. I forgot what this is called, but it says um direct immediately following the Xbox showcase. Now, if you guys don't know the Xbox showcase, I, listen, it's key because you guys know, man. On my channel, I, I cover all the new game, popular games, etc. I, I cover absolutely everything. You, listen, no game will, will not escape my escape my vision. Okay, like I gotta know all these. Now, of course, I've known, like I know that the uh, that the Xbox showcase, uh, the Xbox game showcase is June 9th. I know that. <laughs> I know. I know. That, I know that. Like 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 a mark at the back of my hand. Of course, I know that. There, like I said, there's nothing escaping this vision. Nothing, okay? There's, bro, my eyes are like a pinball, bro. I see everything, bro. Bro, there's nothing to escape this vision, bro. So, when I saw this, I was like, hmm, wait a minute. So, 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 are they going to drop this at, like, the at the end of the Xbox showcase? Like, how are they going to do this, you know? And if I'm being honest with you, I think it's a good plan. It makes sense that they're dropping it, um, like, at the Xbox Showcase, because, number one, if you guys don't know, like, Call of Duty trailers, they usually drop in the summertime. It, actually, in June. They usually drop in June, whether it's early June, late June. Um, you know, Xbox trailers, they don't really drop late. They they legit drop in June or July. So, I was already expecting a Call of Duty trailer um, next month or, like, the month after or, like, in July. Um, it's just, like, I didn't get any word for it yet, which, I mean, like I said, it's, like, around May you know, you got all these Call of Duty channels making the speculations because they know that a, that a Call of Duty trailer is going to drop in the uh, summertime of this year. I mean, they always drop like a trailer, like a, a teaser trailer or, or a gameplay trailer or whatever. They always drop a trailer in the summertime, whether it's June or July, which most likely is June. Um, and so I was already expecting a trailer. And so now that I got this information, I now know. And so obviously, I'm going to be at the Xbox Game Showcase. Y'all, yep, bro. Of course I am, just like millions of other people. I'm gonna be there, uh, and I'm gonna, you know, catch up on like all the, you know, trailers, whatever, da da da. da. But I'm gonna have my eyes peeled for that Call of Duty trailer because guess what? That's going up first. <laughs> That's going up first. We all know. Listen, listen. Y'all know me. That Call of Duty trailer is going up first, and guess what? I have all the information. Um. So yeah, I'm really excited about that. And so, another thing. No worry, I got multiple screenshots by the way. And so we're gonna get to that. We're gonna, we're gonna, just wait. We're gonna get to that real quick. So, this is what I was talking about before. I actually got them all right. That's actually crazy. Uh, so, yeah, Call of Duty Black Ops. So, this is the speculation of a lot of people saying that it was going to be called Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Um, if I'm being honest with you, I think they're going to call it Call of Duty Black Ops 5. I think they're going to call it Call of Duty Black Ops 5. I think they're not going to count the Cold War thing. I think they're legit going to call it Call of Duty Black Ops 5. That's what I think. And the reason I think that is because if you guys don't remember, like our Modern Warfare 2, our Modern Warfare 3, those names are already taken because Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 came out 10 years ago. Call of, Modern, uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 came out uh, 10 years ago as well. And obviously, like, you know, they use, they use like uh, Makarov for like the uh, like Modern Warfare 3 as like the villain or whatever. Um, but if you guys don't know, that took place in like the current time. That took place at like they actually used like the current time for that. And honestly, they really could have just used anything for, like for like the um and I understand like in See, here's the thing though. I was about to say like I understand like uh like because they they basically use like the same plot of Makarov killing Soap, you know, because if you guys don't know, Makarov killed Soap in both the uh Modern Warfare 3 10 years ago. And the current one. Like, he killed Soap in both. That man, Soap is, bro, 2-0. and oh. I'm sorry. Makarov is 2-0. and oh. Like, Soap just got done in both of them. And if I'm being real with you, I understand why they named it, like, the same game. It was because, like, it had, like, the same plot or whatever. But at the end of the day, if we're all being honest here, like, I don't even know which one's the canon. Like, I don't, I don't even know which one's, like, the regular. I think the current one right now is the regular storyline. I think... After Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, I think they were they just restarted it, it all. I, I, actually, ever since Call of Duty Modern Warfare in the, the 2019 version, I think that that's like, I think that was the start of like the, the original just 
full, like, you know, not full, the original, like, storyline, I think they restarted it. Because if you guys don't know, the first Call of Duty uh, Modern Warfare game was Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. Um, the one that dropped in 2019 was Call of Duty Modern Warfare. It, it was just simply just Call of Duty Modern Warfare. It wasn't Call of Duty 4. It was just Call of Duty uh, Modern Warfare. So we'll see how that is. But for this game right here, I think I think they're going to call it Call of Duty Black Ops 5. I, I don't think they're going to call it. At first, I was thinking, oh, 6 because it makes sense. But I don't think so. I think they're, they're going to call it uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 5. Um, and here's what I think so. Jeff actually pointed this out. Phase Jeff pointed this out yesterday in his video. So as you can see right here, this is the logo, whatever, da 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 And so if you look closely, and he's right here, you can see he actually pointed this out. I didn't even notice this. So, bro, shout out to Phase Jeff, bro. He's always, what a goat. I didn't even notice this. So if you look in these words, you can see Black Ops. And then I think this is a V. I, Jeff said the same thing. He said this is a V. At first, I'm like, uh, nah, that could be like a six, right? That could be like a like like a like a Roman numeral six. But then I wondered to myself, a Roman numeral six, that thing has wait a minute, a Roman numeral six has the V and then the uh, it has the V and then the I, right? I think a no, a Roman numeral six has the V and the I. Am I right? Yeah, I am right. It has the V and then the I. And then I was like, hold up. But like, what about... But then I'm like, what about six? And I was like, hold up. He's actually right. Because if you look at it, black, you can see the ops right there. You see like the... Uh, if you guys never seen like a black ops logo, the way they put their O, it's not like a regular like oval O. It's like a... Boom, 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 boom. It's like a, oh, they, that's how they put their O. And then P, you can see the P right there. And then you can see like like a V. Like you, you could just like, like for me right now, I'm legit. I promise you. I, I'm not saying I have like special powers or whatever. But if you zoom in, if you zoom in, you can use your imagination right now. I can legit see in my, I can legit, I, I, maybe I'm weird. But I in my imagination right now, I'm, I'm actually imagining this with my eyes open. I can legit see like the V. I can legit just imagine like, look, boom, black, see the K, boom, boom, ops. Yeah, see, uh, yeah, black, O, P, S, ops, and then I can literally, I can legit, I don't know why, but it's like, it's like I can see through like this, this marker right here, V. That's what I, I that's what I can see right now. That, that's what I think I can see right now. Comment down below. What do you guys think about what? What is the game going to be called? Um, obviously, it's, it's coming out this year. What do you guys think about it? I'm pretty excited for it. And um, sorry, I just you know I I took this long video out of there. I just really wanted to talk about it because you guys know me. I'm really passionate about GTA, Call of Duty, Minecraft. A lot of these games that I grew up with, you know, I'm really passionate about. So, um, you know, if I talk the ear off, my bad. Make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel right now. Uh, if you guys did already, thank you guys so much, bro. We've been going absolutely bonkers. Uh, over the last few months, man, uh, when it comes to the channel, I really I, listen from the bottom of my heart. As a matter of fact, from the bottom to the top of my heart, uh, thank you guys so much, man. Um, I, I legit remember, you know, wanting to do YouTube and wanting to cover gaming and stuff like that. You know, um, you know, just growing up in this whole YouTube game or whatever, and the fact that I finally have something. Okay, I, I just I just hit a hot sauce bottle, but the fact that I can that you know that I can do this every single day. And um and entertain you know and and do what I want you know, and um yeah thank you guys so much man really appreciate it um and yeah because it it wasn't always like this it, it it really wasn't um and the fact that I can actually do it now man is is, is crazy now I'm I'm gonna leave before I get all teary eyed and stuff listen I listen I I understand I'm gonna leave before I get all teary eyed and stuff like that appreciate y'all thank y'all so much again for absolutely everything see you guys at the next one I'm out and.